Well, uh, well, this is interesting. So, quite a few hours ago, I saw this on Discord, and I wanted to eat or something before recording this, so here I am. Uh, also, plug to the recent videos before we get too far into it, you know, uh, Argon Axe Crit Explosion video has gone up, future Melee videos are returning, and, um... I'm also saying this early on just because I don't want to parry videos, and I'm going to be covering the uh, patch notes coming out tomorrow. So we're not going to theorycraft too much on this guy uh, in this video, but let's let's carry on a bit, and I guess we can get to the footnotes. I don't know why I have Spotify blocked. I think a long time ago, I used to just block any time I saw an advertisement on Twitter, and that was early on enough to where few enough people were advertising to where that actually cut down how many ads I was seeing. Now it doesn't help, but either way, the Fortnite crew pack for May, which is happening... Uh, uh, after April, like usual, is offering a, I don't know how to pronounce that, Dimos, Demos outfit, plus a full set, which we can see, I think on here, yeah, just all of his cosmetics. Looks like you get multiple pickaxes and, and back blings. I don't know if he just has multiple styles or what, but there's a lot going on there. And, of course, you get the usual 1,000 V-Bucks, loading screen, battle pass access, and you get Save the World and a Ninja Class Hero uh is, is what he's going to be so i suspect this is again all i'm going to theory craft i'm not even gonna load up the game to show what he could be because we're gonna find out tomorrow um i suspect he might be an axe hero because he's holding an axe that's all i've got for you also mad just confirmed on reddit that he is going to be a reskin so he's not going to be brand new it's going to be an already existing perk uh and of course this he said the blog will be out uh soon he didn't say tomorrow but usually um usually it's on a Tuesday, so given that it's Monday, it should be very, very soon that we're going to find out. But I do want to read through this because I think it's interesting. And uh, I'm going to need... <clears throat> I'm going to need this real quick. A little, little tinfoil hat action because I suspect if they're going to keep plugging Save the World and they're going to keep introducing all of these um, Robo Ray and Starter Packs and all those all those things, uh, it's, just, it's just too hopeful of a statement, okay? I can't say it light... I, I can't say it lightly enough. But, if they're moving it to a Battle Royale crew pack, which is a massive plug to save the world, they've got to have something in the works, right? Like, I just imagine, if they are completely done with save the world, and they're not worried about updating it any further, and they're just going to set this shit on auto, then why on earth would they keep trying to get people to buy save the world? I don't know. I I don't know. This is based off of nothing. That's why the tinfoil hat was on. But it's just something worth thinking about. I'm not trying to inject unnecessary hope into the community. But, y you know, Save the World has been mostly on autopilot for years now. Uh, longer than people notice. Like, I've heard major complaints in the last year or two. But it's... I looked back. I looked back at, like, 2018, right when I started playing. And, like, stuff definitely came out afterwards. Plenty of new weapon sets and whatnot. But... The core of the game never changed. Twine already existed three years ago. I don't know what I'm saying at this point, uh, beyond just that I, uh, it'd be cool if something was in the works. Now, let's go actually, uh, to this, this thing here, uh, the, the overview. This is mostly covering the pack and it's, uh, all of its intricacies and, of course, the BR side of things. I am more interested in the Save the World, and they actually provided a frequently asked question. So, I'm curious how they have that, seeing as literally nobody had any knowledge of this before they posted it, but... Apparently, these were frequently asked questions. Uh, in May's Fortnite crew benefits, you'll get Save the World plus full access to the game forever. Uh, I feel like they repeat themselves a few times, so I'm going to say that right up front. Uh, when you get the crew pack in May, you will get access to a reskinned ninja and Save the World forever. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And if you cancel, you continue to have Save the World. It'll be available on all the regular platforms. These are some really boring FAQs, but... Uh, really boring. Uh, yes, you'll continue to have access, and you will unlock them in Save the World ASAP as possible, which is uh, re very nice to see. <laughs> I just ate a ton of food right before recording. And then, of course, you have to complete the tutorial. You know, I was going to go through this FAQ, but it's mostly just, like, availability questions. And then this is just... This is why I debated making this video before I started recording, but we're too far to turn back now. Um, I just think it's interesting. Honestly, this was more of a video uh, before Magis post. Once it was made clear to me that he's just going to be a reskin, I'm like, huh, that took a lot of the wind out of the sails I had for this video. I also do want to add that um somebody suggested in the discord that they might be discontinuing starter packs i don't know why they do that or anything about that but if they start lumping save the world in with the crew uh the monthly deal that could be 
interesting. I feel like it'd bring more people to save the world, which content creators like me really enjoy. And it could be something worth considering. I also do want to state something that's kind of obvious and that he's going to be a ninja, which means we've now had, uh, or he will make it two ninjas in a row, which I don't really care. It's not that serious. Where's my Ray video? Oh, it's right here. Yeah. So that's going to be two ninjas in a row. And that means of the five starter packs and one crew pack, that is uh, why. And one crew pack that it... Why? What the hell? <laughs> why am I losing access to my channel? Okay. Well, that was weird. Um, We're going to have... Out of the five starter packs and the crew pack, we're going to have three ninjas in there. Which... uh, Kind of weird. Um, But, I don't know. It's just something we're thinking about. I don't really personally care. So long as they are reskinned heroes, this makes no effect on the regular gameplay. It's just something to know. And uh, that's pretty much it. You have now been announced, um, kind of. We're going to talk about the home base report, obviously, in more detail. And we'll discuss which hero he's a reskin of. I'm curious. He's going to be a ninja, and I'm just going totally off of the cosmetics that he's axe-related, which be cool if he was, like, why don't Fiona? That'd be, like, an actually useful hero. Very cool. But... I want to say Dennis Jr., but Dennis Jr. is a constructor. How many Axe Ninjas are there? I don't know. I'm sure there are some that I'm forgetting. It doesn't really matter because Axes are kind of trash. Uh, of course, not the Argon Axe. Definitely not. Actually, no, that, that is legitimately good. I'm not just plugging my video. It it was quite fun to make that video, so you should go check it out. I'll see you guys later, and uh, see you guys tomorrow, and uh, have a nice day.